Hi, I'm Tyler from Chiba Japan, and this is the Hexapod robot that I made. I created the biomimetic rhinoceros beetle robot. I chose the rhinoceros beetle because its heavy body makes efficiency, not speed, most important for its survival, which is optimal for my goal of load-bearing hexapods. First, I observed live rhinoceros beetles, then I used my findings to build a robot, and finally I tested its capabilities. I first measured the beetle's body lengths and observed the rotation of their joints. I then determined its gait with motion tracking. The beetle moved its legs in the order of a tripod gait, but with the legs approximately half a phase out of sync. And while doing this, I noticed that an unusual bump on their bellies seemed to be touching the ground. I confirmed this, and furthermore, I discovered that when walking with heavy loads, they placed over half of their weight on it. Next, I designed a biomedic robot faithfully mimicking beetle anatomy and 3D printed the parts. In the design, I included a supporting structure to mimic the beetle's bump, and I also programmed it to walk in the gate I discovered earlier. Finally, I measured the robot's capabilities. I measured the output current, stability, and weight carrying ability. I found that the gate smoothed that movement, eliminating long gaps, and that the bump saved 30% off energy use. Also, the robot was able to carry 3.1 kilograms, 1.5 times its weight, without a substantial change in its stability or speed. This new form of beetle-inspired hexapod motion has high load-bearing ability while maintaining versatility, and is useful for transporting equipment over uncertain terrain as cave or space rovers.